Hey guys, um, I'm going to try to make this a really, 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 really short video just because I have a ton of things to do today, but um, I've been so busy with school, I've been so busy with so many things that I can't make videos, I just can't, I don't have time. Um, but it's Saturday and you know, it's a little bit of a slow day, um, and I was looking, of course, at um, Donnie's new video. Um, and he's basically saying that the sun um, a while back in Antarctica really wasn't setting. And now it's kind of like touching the horizon and coming back up. Um, and I just wish that he would at one point just one time look into why that's happening why is it that you know three weeks ago the sun wasn't dipping down or touching the horizon at all and now it is so we are on a website here called timeanddate.com they have a whole bunch of stuff they have a sun calculator moon calculator moon phases so on and so forth um, and we have it um, set to the current time today, um, January 28, 2012. And uh, New Meyer Station, I believe, is somewhere down here. Okay. And you can see that the sun, there's a moment where it sort of kind of dips below the horizon. And there's a little bit of a, of a, a sunset. Now it's not dark, it's not in the dark area. The dark area is this. Um, as you can see, you can use um, Africa as an example. Dark, not really dark, not dark at all. And you see how the lights turn on and off, okay? Now we can go back day by day. You can change, you could see the change here and how much the sun actually dips down. I mean, day to day it changes. Um, we're now at January 13th, barely. And you can keep going back. This also tells you the position of the sun I mean, obviously, you got to change the time. This is the same time, just a different day. This is the moon. That's the sun. You can go back as far as you want to see where it is that the sun is. But let's go back to current time. So he's claiming that, you know, something's wrong, something's not normal, as usual as what he normally says. It's just what he does. He, he says things and then doesn't look... To see why it's happening. Now instead of going back. We're going to go forward. And you can see that now. It's actually growing. The area where the sun is dipping below the horizon. Is changing. And it's expanding. And it's coming down. Which means that it's going to be going below the horizon. And then coming back up. That's what this is. Okay. I mean, here we are. This is February 12th. And look at the dramatic change. And you could keep going. I mean, you could do this month by month, day by day, hour by hour. And, um, this is what, March 10th? And it is getting close to, I think, the March equinox. And then it basically shifts. Oops, no, wait, go back. There we go. Sorry, I did week instead of day. You can see that now, basically, Antarctica will be in total darkness, almost. 
the entire time. It changes along the year. It gets, you know, it changes. It's nothing weird. It's nothing that ha never happened before. It happens every year. <laughs> but I just wanted to point that out. I just wanted to show that just because it's dipping a little bit below the horizon and coming back up doesn't mean that, you know, there's some big conspiracy down there. It's changing. Every day it'll change a little bit. And then to the point where Antarctica will be completely dark again. That's what happens. So, keeping promise to a short video. I will put the link to this directly um, so that you guys can check it out for yourself. You can play around with the time, um, the date, and everything else. So, all I, all I say is... If you see something that's a little odd, instead of just blurting things out and saying, oh, well, you know, it's weird and something's going on and, you know, that's not normal, look into it. Um, try to figure out why that's happening. Educate yourself. Um, there's nothing wrong with seeing something and saying, hmm, that seems a little odd. Let me look into it. Um, but when you start blurting things out that make absolutely no sense, you start running into brick walls and that's why people start, um, quote unquote, attacking you. So anyway, um, I hope you guys have a great weekend. I don't know if I'm going to make another video, um, but we'll see. Thanks, guys.